With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello students, question is the normal boiling point of water is 373 Kelvin. Vapor pressure of water at temperature T is 19 millimeters of mercury. The enthalpy of vaporization is 40.67 kilojoule per mole. Then the temperature T would be use log 2 is equal to 0.3 and R value is 8.3 into kilojoule joule per Kelvin per mole. So in this question we are given that the normal boiling point of water is 373 Kelvin and vapor pressure of water at any T temperature is given as 19 millimeters of mercury and enthalpy of vaporization is also given. So we have to calculate the temperature T. So it means we have to we have given that is value of T1 that is 19 millimeters of mercury. So at boiling point at boiling point the pressure will be equals to the atmospheric pressure atmospheric pressure that is normal atmospheric pressure that is 1 atmosphere so this will be equals to 1 atmosphere and 1 atmosphere in millimeters of mercury is 760 millimeters of mercury so P2 will be this and T1 is given sorry T2 is given that its boiling point is given 373 Kelvin and T1 we have to calculate so we and delta G or delta H vaporization is also given that is 40.67 kilojoule per mole so in joule per mole it will be equals to 40.67 into 10 is to power 3 joule per mole so now using the cloches lipran equation which is log P2 by P1 is equal to delta H vaporization upon 2.303 R into T2 minus T1 upon T1 into T2. So using this equation we can calculate the value of T1. So log P2 by P1, P2 is 760. So if we put the values it will be log 760 by 19 and delta H vaporization is 40.67 into 10 raise to power 3 so it will be 4060670 in joule per mole divide by 2.303 into R that is 8.3 joule per Kelvin per mole so this is cancelled and T2 minus T1 will be T2 is 373 minus T1 we have to calculate divide by 373 into T1. So this will be equal to we have to calculate T1 so we will rearrange this equation as 373 minus T1 divide by 373 into T1 equals to 2.303 into 8.3 this is in per Kelvin divide by 4060670 into log of 760 by 19. So 760 by 19 this gives us 40 and log 40 value is 1.602. So this gives us 2.303 into 8.3 divided by 40670 into 1.602. This value will be equals to 0 0.00 equals to 373 minus T1 divided by 373 into T1. So when we cross multiply this, 373 into this value, this gives us 0.28 T1. And this T1 on right hand side it will become 1.28 T1. 
So T1 will be 373 divided by 1.28. This value is equal to 291.4. And this value is in this value is in per Kelvin. So if this value is in per Kelvin, so it will when it is divided by this it goes to so it would be 291.4 Kelvin. So it means the initial temperature is 291.4. So the correct answer to this question is B option 291.4 that is B option. I hope you understood the solution. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITJ and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.